Okay, so my name is Domi Nyage. I am a lawyer and I come from Nigeria. And um, I heard about Transparency International first from the place I was working with. And um, they had encouraged us to come because we had done, we're doing work with accountability and um, transparency in our government and trying to encourage public officials to do that. So basically, I heard about it. I put in an application, especially because it was a new, we've been looking for, of course, innovative ways to do better things in our country because we have a really high rate of corruption and it seems like it's a norm and so we i just felt like i needed to learn more and interact with other people to know what to do how they are doing theirs and how they're tackling and just to share ideas basically so ti school i had a lot of expectations really i was excited especially because i was going to meet different people from different places you know it's um I came here and I thought that I was like the only one that was going to come with a really high index of corruption complaining about it in my country and I got here and everyone seems to be tussling and telling about the tales of how terrible the system is in their places. Oh, I loved the lectures, I really did because for every one of them it had proper content and the diversification of how corruption spans across not just one government sector but everywhere else and how we can fix that. I want to believe that because we're also very different people here with different careers, everyone has had something to relate with and how they can take it back to their own working sector. So for me that was really, really important and one of the highlights of my experience here. It's just important to me that as young people we try to change the status quo, starting with ourselves, being honest with ourselves and not take things that are supposed to be abhorred as though they are normal so that so from there we start from one person at a time and then hopefully um, we everyone catches the fire and then we're able to have a more qualitative as opposed to quantitative movement against fight uh, against corruption